Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be my makeup audit video. I am going to write all of the numbers down in my notebook. Um, as far as totals, let me know how many eyeshadow palettes you think I have. My husband gave me a guess when I came downstairs just now of 175. I haven't counted anything yet. I'm gonna pause the video count everything and I'll come back. It'll probably be a half an hour for me. It'll be like two seconds for you, but let me know down below, I guess. I am gonna do a, um, a giveaway in this video. So all you have to do to enter is leave me a guess down below. I have two lip glosses uh, that I will be the main, that will be the main focal point. I think that was the main focal point in the last giveaway. But if you talk to Angie, the winner of the last giveaway, I sent her a big mailer with a bunch of stuff. So I will throw in some things out of my overflow box on top of the two lip glosses. But you have to give me a guess. And then if the person that selected got close, I'll probably give them some extra goodies. I'll probably give them extra goodies anyway, but leave me your guesses down below. Like I said, Mike had a guess of 175 as far as eyeshadow palettes. So we will see. I have not, this is my, I have a little bit of wine in here, probably the equivalent of a small glass, but I hate these like cheap tumblers. This is one from like the spirit store. My mother-in-law gave it to me. The lids never want to close on these, but the last time I did a count, I had 165 eyeshadow palettes. That's the largest number I've ever had. I have decluttered some since then, but if you've been watching my haul videos, I've also bought a bunch. So like I said, Mike has a guess of 175. The last number I had probably a year ago was 165. So leave me your guesses down below. I'm gonna go count everything and we will come back with the audit. This is going to segue into a declutter series. So after this video, I'm gonna start doing categories and I will declutter things. I'm not looking to declutter a ton, but I do wanna go through everything and make sure again that everything that I have is stuff that I potentially wanna use and I'm not just keeping things to hoard them. I am gonna have some more space if you watched my last video where I packed my caboodle, you saw I have extra storage. We moved everything downstairs. So I'm gonna have some more space, but I don't like to hoard things just for hoarding them. Eyeshadow palettes are harder for me to declutter just because I do makeup looks, but the other categories of things, I would rather pass stuff on that I'm not gonna use to somebody that's gonna use it instead of hoarding it. So yeah, let me go get numbers and then we will jump into the audit. Okay, I just got done with the count. I did pull out the two lip glosses that'll be featured in the giveaway, and then I'm gonna pull out some other stuff out of my overflow bin. And then with my last giveaway, I included a couple lightly used items. So if you're okay with that too, I'll do the same thing. But I have this hard candy Insta Pout, and then this, if this is in the shade Coral, this, these are both lip glosses, but I'm gonna let it run for about two weeks. So however far we get, I will include some gently used stuff if you're okay with that, because my friend Michaela that I normally give stuff to, I think is getting overwhelmed. So if I can pass stuff along, I will. So let's get into the numbers. Again, before we start, leave me your number for eyeshadow palettes down below. That'll be the last number that I give you. Okay, so for loose powder, I had 14. Press powder is eight, which I was kind of surprised that that was such a low number. It takes a while to go through a press powder. It takes a while to go through loose powder too, but I was surprised that that was almost half because I feel like I use press powder more, but it is what it is. Setting spray. I have 18. I didn't count my backup of my e.l.f., the 16 hour. I do have a backup of that I discovered, but I didn't count. I just counted the one that was open. Lip serum, lip balm, lip mask. I have a basket of all that stuff. There were 16 items in that basket. 
Concealers, I have 14. I have two color correctors, the Pixie and then that other one that's in my caboodle. Brow pencils, I had 18. Three powders, one wax and two pomades. Liquid liners was 23. That included colored ones. Uh, mascara was 12. Eye primer was nine. That included my NYX glitter glue and then the Alamar one, which is a little bit sticky. So I also consider that a glitter glue. That was all under eye primer. Colored eyeliners, as far as like black or colors that I use in the waterline, like pencils. So eyeliner pencils was 42. I do have a lot of those and I included my colored pomades and my water activated liners in that. Liquid eyeshadow and shadow sticks was 28. Single shadows was 19. I didn't count my glitters. I started to get overwhelmed at that point. Face palettes, which is blush, highlight, bronzer kind of a thing. I have a separate drawer. Uh, there were 22. Highlighters was 43, that's powder highlighters. Powder blushes was 51, powder bronzers was 21. Cream highlighters was nine. I'm not surprised that that number was so low because I don't really use liquid highlighters. I'm trying to get into them, but cream blushes was 11 and then cream bronzers was 14. I've been really liking cream bronzers lately, so I'm not surprised that that number was higher. Lip gloss. And this also included lip oils, was 34. I think that's the only reason that number is so high because I don't really use lip gloss, but like I said, I included lip oils in the same category. Lipsticks, as in bullet lipsticks, and also tinted lip balms was 75, which again, that is why that number is so high because I included both my tinted balms and lipsticks because they're both in a stick form. Liquid lipsticks was 124, so I need to cut that down. So that's going to be one that I really hit hard with the declutter. Face primers was 17, foundations was 15, and that also included my mineral powder foundation. And then eyeshadow palettes. This included my four pan like elf palettes, my little quads or five pan elf palettes, the little five pan, four pans, and my little quads so that everything was 260. This is the highest number that I have ever had, ever. So I really, not that I need to cut that number down, but I definitely wanna go through and make sure that the stuff that I have is stuff that I like and either have used and I'm like planning on using or have the potential of wanting to use. I want to make sure that every eyeshadow palette I have is something that I like the color story of. I like the palette. I don't want to keep stuff, like I said, just for the sake of hoarding it. So I need to make sure I'm going to go through those. And I am somebody that likes to collect eyeshadow palettes too. Like I still have my Urban Decay Electric palette. So I do have a few that are older. Um, I still use them. I don't, the only makeup that I keep for nostalgia, I have the very, our very first Valentine's Day, Mike gave me the mini white chocolate palette from Too Faced. I have that on my dresser. A couple of the shadows got messed up. I tried to go in with a wet brush. I have the full size white chocolate bar palette, but I don't tend to keep eyeshadow palettes necessarily for sentimental purposes, but I do collect them. So if they're usable, like my electric palette, I will hold on to them. But I want to make sure, because I have a lot of palettes that I've never used, but I want to make sure that I at least like them and I'm not just keeping them for the sake of keeping them. Because I know I have a few that I've decluttered and put back and decluttered and put back. So I definitely need to go through those, but yeah. That is my entire list. Let me know if there was any numbers that surprised you. I'm a little surprised by the liquid lipstick number because at one point in time I had a drawer when I was using my drawer system and I had multiple drawers, multiple drawer systems. I had a drawer that was just liquid lipsticks and I know the number had to have been higher than what I have because that drawer at one point was maxed out. I have them all in acrylic 
holders but I feel like that number is excessive considering how little I wear liquid lipstick. So I want to cut my bullet lipstick number down and I want to cut the liquid lipstick number down. So I'm going to go through all of those. And cut that. Yeah, cut, cut that down. I don't know how much I'm going to cut the eyeshadow palette number down because I have decluttered in the last six months. But have purchased a lot recently so that's why the number is so high but I do have several palettes that I've had for a long time like one or two years that I've never used so I need to look at those and make sure that I still like them enough to keep them so that's where we're at with the numbers thank you so much for being here the next video will be either an organizational video or a declutter video. I'm not sure if I'm gonna declutter before I start moving stuff around or after, but either way, those are the videos that are coming. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out. And again, there is a giveaway. The two feature items are the lip glosses and then I will throw some other stuff in. So all you have to do is leave me a comment and then let me know if you want me to respond to the YouTube comment or if you want to provide me your Instagram handle, don't leave me your email address because it will kick your comment out. But if you would prefer me to contact you via email, give me like an Instagram or TikTok handle and then I can message you through there and then you can give me your email address if that makes sense. But yeah, just give me, leave me a comment, make sure you're subscribed and then just leave me either you know, I can reply to your comment or give me your Instagram handle will be the easiest way to contact you. So yeah, thank you guys so, so much. I appreciate you hanging out. It feels like it's been uh, longer for me than it has for you. This is a fairly short video, but I've been down here for like an hour and a half. So it feels like a long time. Thank you so much. Make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. And hopefully I'll see you in another video very, very soon. Bye everybody.